Hey guys, I just wanted to um, get back on and um, go over a little bit of information from today. Um, we were looking at um, dividing decimals by decimals. So I'm gonna flip it around to the notes and um, help you with some more with some of the problems. Oh, please ignore the messy desk. Okay, so here we have um, part of our notes that, that we looked at today. Um, this part, um, I was telling you that you want to make your divisor that you're dividing by a whole number by multiplying by powers of 10. So if we had this problem, okay, we had the, I'm going to rewrite it in my journal so you can, you can maybe see it a little bit better. If we had, um, ten and thirty five hundredths, right? Divided by four and five tenths. And so what I told you in class was to write it with the um, fraction bar as the division sign and the four and five tenths. This would be your divisor. I'm gonna label the terminology for you. And this is the dividend. And your answer, if you remember, in a um, division problem as quotient. And so <clears throat> we looked at that there was one decimal place. And so since there, was, since there was one decimal place, you would have to multiply by 10. And so we would multiply the dividend and the divisor by 10. Remember, you gotta be fair. What you do to one, you have to do to the other. Sorry that I'm shaking that. And then um, we would get on the top, we would end up with um, 100, 103 and 5 tenths divided by 45. Okay, so that's really basically um, kind of as far as we got in class. So now I wanna you know, go through some examples of the actual division that you, you know how to do the regular division from um, previous grades, but you just want to make sure that you go ahead before you start dividing and um, put that decimal in the quotient. And so <clears throat> uh, we know that 45 won't go into 1, won't go into 10, but it will go into 103. Um, I know that 40 times 2 is 80, 5 times 2 is 10, and so 45 times 2 is going to be 90. And then we will um, subtract. And 3 minus 0 is 3. 10 minus 9 is 1. And I end up with 13 left over. I want to continue uh, dividing. So I bring down the 5 and I'm able to divide 45. We'll go into 135. Uh, 45 is close to 50, so I'm thinking three times. So if I go over to the side, multiply 45 times 3. 5 times 3 is 15. Carry the 1. 4 times 3 is 12, plus 1 is 13. So yes, it is. So 3 times 45 gives me 135 exactly, and I have 0 left over. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so the first step was... Right, the problem using the fraction bar to represent, sorry about that, I keep hitting this, to represent the fraction bar to represent division. Okay, step two, make your, make um, your divisor, 